Okay, this is uh, Saturday, November 2nd. Up here uh, playing with scrapers again. This is the two wheel. New draw bar installed. Got the rise on it. Get my height closer. Modified the coupling holder so these will lock into place better. Not such a struggle to get them connected and disconnected. New couplers, of course. Yeah, so it's coming along good. So let's crank up this tractor show you how it works. It's my 2030. It's weighted up pretty good. Tires are fluid filled. They're another I think 500 pounds each. Alright. We've got dual remotes on this tractor. I'm using the upper remote. Okay, the lower push forward. Alright. You see how when I push it all the way forward, it rose up a lot. That's going into dig mode. Alright, so let's raise it back up. Pull back to raise. This is transport mode. You want to watch for your clearance down there on the bottom. Make sure you got plenty of clearance for transport. We'll continue to raise to full dump. dump mode. It's not the most level spot in the world where I parked. On this side I got four inches from the blade edge to the ground. On the other side it's closer to six. So when you dump, it will dump and you'll get a four to six inch layer obviously. That's what you want. There you see the other side. Box is not totally vertical. Uh, you really don't need totally vertical. So we'll cycle through it again. There we go. We're back to raise. Now we're going to go forward to dig. Still got travel. It pulls in for dig mode, so I still got travel. So I can go deeper than I thought. Uh, the rise on that hitch is only a little over two inches, and so my dig depth I can probably go up to four to five inches on this thing at, at full extension, which is a lot. I won't ever go that deep, but you can regulate that with your hydraulic. So, new cylinders, doing fine. I was going to put on different tires. I'm having a heck of a time finding the 8 inch wide rim that I need with the correct center hole and the uh, correct bolt pattern. So for now, I'm going to have to use what I got here. Everything looking good, no leaks on the hydraulics. Let's put it back up into dump mode. We'll disconnect and go hook on to the four wheel scraper over there in the distance. Uh, got all repairs done on it. We'll check it out, see how it's doing. That's all for this one. Thank you.